Hi guys, today I have a special project in collaboration with my former scientist colleagues. They need to have a piece made out of Teflon or PTFE. It is very weird material. It is expensive. This plate here, uh, 12 by 12, half inch thick, costs almost $200. It is a kind of plastic that has very good dielectrical properties. And that's the reason that my friends want to use it. But it also has high tensile strength. So it wouldn't be very sticky to cut with my high speed spindle. The material and the bit might heat up very quickly. I'm afraid that Teflon will stick to the bit and ruin everything. I have no experience with this. So I will try to take all the precautions I can to reduce the risk. Uh, I wouldn't have to cut a bit slow for precision. That's what they require. I wouldn't use 4mm single flute flat end mill. I wouldn't blow compressed air to the tip of the bit. This is to clear the chip and also cool down the bit, just like milling aluminum. I install this dust guard to prevent the chip from flying everywhere. I wouldn't have to stand here and vacuum everything that fly out using my very noisy sharp rag. Let's hope that everything will go smoothly. I don't want to waste this very expensive material.
it actually cut a lot better than I thought. Most of the edges are pretty clean. There's a few things stick on the edge here, but I can scratch them off quite easily or with my fingernail or maybe with the tip of a razor blade. Let me just take it out, clean it up and show you how it looked like. Here's the final product after I clean it up. As you can see that everything will cut really smoothly, all the edges were really clean and all the dimensions are exactly as I designed. So milling Teflon is quite easy because it's kind of soft and you can use almost any type of end mill to cut it. I'm not sure that the piece will cut nicely because I took all the precautions or maybe Teflon is just not too hard to cut. I don't know but I prefer being safe than sorry. So if you need to mill Teflon you know what to do.